Geophysicists are now hypothesizing about the San Andreas fault line triggering a massive earthquake, and this is due to new information, a new study that is showing that the fault may be at a higher risk than previously thought. We have researchers at Arizona State University now publishing this new study that is looking into the likelihood of a 7.5 magnitude or stronger quake occurring or rupturing the entire fault line. Now, it has long been thought that the central section of the fault line, which stretches 90 miles from San Juan Batista southward toward Parkfield, was creeping steadily in such a way that it provided for safe releases of energy. Well, now they're saying that this creeping movement is actually giving more of a chance of a bigger quake down fault. It's adding more pressure in other areas that are basically tightly connected and don't have the loose fit as an upward part of the fault line. This is a look at just the past seven days here in California. And you can see the activity and where it stops right here at these faults. I've talked about the Juan de Fuca and these plates and everything else, the Cascadia, several times before in past videos that you can check out if you've missed them. And you can see that this is an active region, well, the most active region in the United States uh, from what I see in following the earthquake maps. But Southern California, among the most active of all these regions, all the way down toward the Salton Sea, as you can see right here. And right here, this is a key spot I always talk about. This is where that fault kind of breaks loose right at the Salton Sea and then picks back up here in terms of a fault line on the other side. You can see how we got swarming little pockets around this area. It's just one to keep an eye on because this is an area they project that if it ever does come unzipped, it's going to start here and make its way to the northwest. And it would be a reverberation off the mountains getting stronger as it passes through these areas. But this is some new information here put out by these scientists, geologists, geophysicists that are working on this out of Arizona. Anytime we get a new study like this with new information, I think it's worth taking a look at and adding it to the equation because we all know California is kind of long overdue for a big one. And this information helps in trying to decipher all of that. But I'll leave a link and I'll continue to update with more info as I come across it. As always, this has been Dabu7. Peace.